you will find some of your favorite celebs, well-known entertainers, everyday people, and even some of your favorite beauty bloggers rocking these hairstyles here. Here's how to do a Bessie Goddess spray plus top knot. Don't forget to subscribe. Hey guys, welcome back. So here are two easy hairstyles to achieve. And yeah, I don't know what I was seeing right there, but let's jump right to the tutorial. All right, so you want to start off with a side part. And we're going to kind of curve that part straight down the middle. You want to section your hair off and just pull it to one side. Of course, I'm using my favorite gel here. And I am just cleaning up the edges just, just a little bit. And then once this is done, I'm using the side of my brush to kind of help mold the hair into place. And then now I'm just French braiding my hair. All right, so you French braid your hair towards the back. Make sure you don't do a tight stitch because we will make this braid look mix messy. <laughs> and then on to the other side, you want to do the same thing for the other side. Now I'm making sure I braid this close to the edges right here because we're going to also mess this braid up. So remember, do not do a tight stitch when you braid. All right, so from the start of the braid, you want to go ahead and start tugging at the stitches. So don't tug too hard, all right? Just tug a little bit. And I failed to mention that my hair is straightening. So it's at this last stage just of being straightened right before wash day. So I, was, I wanted to get the style up. So I'm tugging it almost to the back. And then once that's done, I'm going to take a couple bobby pins here. And I'm just going to crisscross those braids right over each other. And I'm going to pin them in place. And like I said, do a little bit more tugging at your height, whatever you like. But I just want to show you how the style looks. And this completes this style here. Very cute, protective style. All right, on to the next. So here, this style requires a few more steps, but it's definitely achievable. All right, so you want to part the front of your hair up into a horseshoe parting here. And then you will session the back off. And next, what we do here is add three braids to the front. So I'm just sectioning it off, and I like to start with my middle braid first. So remember, do not braid tight. I uh, kind of make the mistakes braiding the last two tight, but don't do what I did. Make sure you braid it somewhat loose. only applied a little gel to the edges you don't really have to do that remember sometimes you have to be careful of your texture when um, doing your styles because you know you don't want one part of your hair look slick and the other part don't so just be, keep that in mind but anyway I'm doing a loose braid going towards the crown area and I'm just tying the rest of that into a ponytail there and then I'm loosening this up so I know you all have seen these styles they are so cute and they are so easy and the great thing about it, they are messy like it don't have to be really neat so that's why i really like these hairstyles here but keep tugging you want to create as much volume as possible whatever you like to do go ahead and do that and then you also want to tuck at the braids in the front so like i said remember don't braid these too tight because as you can see i am struggling just a little bit but i left the ends loose so it's a little bit easier for me to tug it Now that we got our braids the way we like them. So now I'm just pinning my hair into a, like a top knot bun here. So I am also crisscrossing the braids over each other. It's kind of create, you know, like that braid wrap around your bun. You know, I'm really into that. So just want to emphasize on the goddess part of the uh, hairstyle. So that's why I chose to wrap it around the bun. And this pretty much completes this hairstyle as well. Very cute, very chic. Um, yeah, I go in to again a little bit more. I use a few more uh, body pins to secure the sides down because I don't want as much volume on the sides. And here you go. So very cute. I might uh, do a different style of this here. But go ahead, thumbs up the video and comment down below for any ideas on the next tutorial. All right, guys. Till next time. Bye.